Imagine this, the universe is expanding, and it has been since the moment of the Big Bang nearly 13.8 billion years ago. Galaxies drift apart, stars carry on their silent journeys, and cosmic time flows like a river. For decades, astronomers assumed this expansion would gradually slow. Gravity, the invisible hand of the cosmos, should pull everything together. The universe they thought was coasting toward a slow, elegant collapse, a cosmic deceleration. But in the late 1990s, something extraordinary was discovered. The expansion of the universe isn't slowing down, it's speeding up. The galaxies are flying apart faster today than they ever have. And the force behind this acceleration, it's invisible, mysterious, and everywhere. It's called dark energy. The discovery was accidental. Two independent teams of astronomers, led by Saul Perlmutter, Brian Schmidt, and Adam Reese, were studying distant supernovae, exploding stars that shine as brightly as entire galaxies. Dark energy is the ultimate cosmic enigma. We cannot see it, we cannot touch it, and we do not know what it is. Yet it dominates the cosmos. Roughly 68% of the universe's total energy density is dark energy. Only about 5% is ordinary matter. The atoms that make up planets, stars, and life. The rest, 27%, is dark matter. The invisible scaffolding of the universe. If its strength remains constant, the universe will continue to accelerate forever. Galaxies beyond our local cluster will disappear from view, receding faster than the speed of light. Stars will burn out, planets will drift in endless darkness, and the cosmos will become cold, lonely, and isolated. A fate physicists call the Big Freeze. Dark energy challenges the boundaries of science itself. It forces us to question our understanding of space, time, matter, and the very laws of physics. When you look at the night sky, those stars, planets, and galaxies are only a fraction of reality. The space between them, vast, empty, and invisible, is filled with energy that shapes everything silently. We cannot see it, we cannot feel it, and we cannot hold it in our hands. Yet it defines the cosmos. It decides the fate of galaxies, the rhythm of cosmic expansion, and perhaps the ultimate destiny of all that exists.